11 now. He says he wants to just play golf after an incredible 35 years with a high school that still only needs one name. Frank DeAngelis talking with 7 News in the past two hours about his decision to retire as principal of Columbine High School. 15 years after he helped lead the school through the shooting tragedy back in 1999. 7 News reporter Tyler Lopez live at Columbine right now. Tyler, one teacher saw this coming. Yeah, a lot of folks, Christine, say it's really not a surprise. They've been waiting for this day. In fact, one teacher who was here on that terrible day says he's been waiting for this day, the day that Mr. D, as they call him, would stop taking care of them and start taking care of himself. And that day will come at the end of this upcoming school year. The principal, Frank DeAngelis, talking with us today in the new library, just one of the sections of the school that is different since 12 students and a teacher were killed by two fellow students on April 20th, 1999. While one teacher tells me that only one third of the school's staff remains since that day, DeAngelis has been the constant, the emotional leader, not just of this school, but the entire community. But the principal, he was quick to thank his instructors. I couldn't have done it without him. And I knew that all I had to do was walk down the hallway and there was a hug. Or I knew when he came into my office and I'm so proud that they allowed me to be a part of their life. Now, DeAngelis helped create a family atmosphere, that teacher told me, and made such a difference as these folks continued going on. In fact, he says the principal sheltered and protected the staffers from folks like the media so they could concentrate on the kids. DeAngelis himself, he is engaged and will remarry at the end of the year, but he also says, Christine, he's not sure how he's going to fill all the extra hours that will now be on his plate. Live in Littleton, Tyler Lopez, 7 News.